Last week on Friday, got up to about 32 degrees. Cooled down for the weekend, and now Monday, the next few days, it's heating back up again. Let's try and look like that old lady from Benador. That's the aim. But, you know, we're going to start the day off with a coffee, of course. But let's have a nice coffee. They've been hitting this spot while it's been hot in the UK. Yes, Bonnie, what are you saying, man? What did you say? What's that? Oh, okay, fair enough. She's just put it in a glass. It's more fancier. <laughs> the glass says fancy as well. Please, eyes don't be all clumped up together. You know what? Holding the phone and me being in the middle, for me, for some reason, is really fucking difficult. It's a fucking task, man. It's not annoying at all. Sweet. Ah, oh, that's really cold. Just a smidge at the bottom. Get some cold water. Check, check this bow. Oh. <laughs> Is that ticking that box for you, creatively? <sighs> I'm probably gonna shit it right back out, but. Right, let's smash some shoulders and chest. Again, about four or five sets, 10 to 12 reps, you know. And still, hay fever is living rent free in my fucking nose. Right, super set now with um, bench press and then push ups. Great combo. Absolute killer. Especially the push up board. If you're holding like handles, it's a lot harder than just doing normal push ups. Jeez, check out this angle, man. It's a little 0 0.5 zoom out and it's from like a side angle, which you should really be doing. Like when I'm doing it on my front, you'll just see my crotch and my legs spread. So it's not very nice. Just realised this cap needs an, a wash, mate. Like, look at it. Shoulder raises, shoulder fires, whatever you want to call them. Oh my god, that even does your core. Oh my god, I just fucking tripped over my own foot. Alright, chest flies. Oh my hat. Shh. Well, should use them up, huh? Five eggs? I'll go on then. No. We had chicken yesterday, and we just put it in the cupboard just to let it cool down, and now I'm put it back in the fridge. There's a nice leg in there. Fuck. Wasted protein. Slap some butter in there, because this is no longer a non-stick pan, and it hasn't really been for a while, so I've got to slap some butter in. I assume you guys can clearly oh see the hair. Please, get out. Oh, women. Joking. I need a cameraman or woman. I need one. I, another fucking... Are you taking the piss?
That was a solid workout. Might be a bit excessive. I don't, I, I'm not massively hungry. It's 20 past nine. I woke up about half six. Sleeping schedule's been pretty good recently. But the thing is, I wake up so early and then by like seven, I feel like an old man. I'm fucking tired as fuck. Five eggs, wow. Got some sriracha. Also, I haven't done the intro yet because I don't know what I'm actually going to record today. So let's just roll with it. It's a vlog. So it won't just be me eating this. I mean, a few of the eggs are, should be runny. There you go. Let's get some of these eggs down me, shall we? Mmm, nice warm yolk. Hot sauce and eggs, great combo. What was that to talk about? I just don't know. My brain just goes to the weather. I don't know, it's just it's all we fucking talk about in the UK. I mean, I would be talking about what I'm going to do in this fucking video, but I don't know. And that's just the way it goes sometimes. I've got a few ideas, but... Great start to the day with these eggs. I'd rather eat this than like, you know, having two eggs and then snacking on a chocolate bar and whatever, you know? I'm trying to fill up on good protein, apart from when I eat fast food, but that doesn't count. I don't eat fries when I go to McDonald's, okay? People in the UK, do you guys enjoy the heat? I know some of you just fucking like, don't like it. Like, I love the heat, I love the sunshine. Well, I embrace it, it's good for you. You get a nice tan. There's science behind it, it makes you feel good. But you know, when it's like kind of getting in the evening and it's still like 25 degrees and it's humid and the heat here in the UK is different. Even last night, it cooled down a bit. Now it's heating up again, but last night it cooled down a bit and I just randomly get hot flushed. I'm like, fuck, all of a sudden I'll be hot as fuck. Just sweating. So many fucks and fuckings in this video, Jesus. I'm thoroughly enjoying these eggs. So I've got three tins here. Uh, we got baked beans and sausages. I know a lot of people don't like sausages in the in the with, with the beans. Fucking hell! But I quite like it. But this is probably going to be disgusting. Got spaghetti. Oh, but I thought they were spaghetti hoops, but they call them spaghetti loops. I uh, haven't had these in a while. It's gonna be a big throwback again. I'm no spaghetti hoop or bean connoisseur, so it's going to be difficult to kind of compare them. If I had beans, it'd kind of be from Sainsbury's or just like their better range. It wouldn't be like Sainsbury's Basics um, or Heinz. So, you know, I know, you know, they're decent. And then I've never tried an Irish stew. I've got an Irish stew here. That should be very interesting. I did want to get a chili con carne, but I just couldn't see it in there. So I'm just going to try three. The beans came to 42p. The spaghetti loops were 16p. And the Irish stew was 75p, the most expensive out of all of them. And I also bought golden vegetable savoury rice. Right. Um, this was this was 28p and it yeah, it's a bit strange. Could be little rocks in there, you don't know. I'm gonna try this for a short, so if you guys wanna see me trying this for a short video, then um watch it. It'll come out tomorrow. So yeah, check out the shorts. So all of it in total, because I bought a bag and I didn't want to be walking around carrying as the smart price, because I care about what people think sometimes, which I shouldn't. Um the bag was 20p. So in total I spent one pound ninety. No, one pound eighty-nine. I'm literally just gonna be back with these either in a bowl or just like this. This looks interesting. It smells alright to be fair. Ew. I mean, also shout out to uh, like Chris the Butcher. He's done quite a few like tin videos because I saw his the other day and I was like, 30p. That's all I can fucking afford at the moment. So I might as well buy a few tins, do you know what I mean? And try them for a video. And uh, Steve Eats as well, I think he did a chili con carne, hence why I was going to get chili con carne from Asda, but I didn't. So yeah, ch sick. You know, I mean, what the food you're getting... Oh fuck, I'll just show you. The food you're getting, obviously, I mean, the, the actual portions... Are nuts, you know, they're good, but what it actually is like the tomato sauce smells a bit weird. I brought some salt and pepper in case it's that bad. Um, yes, yeah, so let's get into it. I've read out everything, these two really do have a weird smell. The stew actually looks decent. Now, I am quite hungry, I've already edited everything you've seen before before this segment of the video where I'm eating these tin, this tin food. Um, so it's quite a few hours later since I've had eggs, so I actually am very hungry now. All right, let's try the beans, just by themselves. They taste fine to me, mate. Like, buzz of, like, you always get put off by these things, but are they that bad? Like, Obviously, if I had Heinz next to me, 
It might have been in different stories, you know what I mean? But it tastes pretty good. Let's have a sausage. Tastes the same as the sausages you would get in a tin of baked beans, do you know what I mean? So, that slapped on some bread would be decent. The sauce is actually nice. It had a weird smell. But, as it, again, I am hungry and I've been kind of cutting, so kind of just eating these kind of simple foods are still nice to me because I'm not eating as much sugar and blah, blah, blah. So, but, what the fuck? Nice. Right. Oh, shit. I really want to try this uh, casserole here. I'm, I'm curious. Irish casserole. Bits of potatoes, carrots, peas. Looks quite healthy. It's probably the biggest bit of meat you're going to get in there. You know, it just tastes like fat. Um, it's all right. I mean, I kind of expected a bit more flavour. Well, did I expect more flavour? Because it's cheap as shit. This is like a pound or so for all this, so. You know, add a bit of salt paper to it, which I'm gonna do right now. I mean, this one's the most expensive out of them all. Um, 75 peas is, you expect a bit more for 75 peas, but I'm really shocked with them beans. Really shocked. That's nicer. <laughs> but the, the, you know, these are meals, like, you know, especially if you, you know, bulking aside, like, you know, if you just want a quick meal and you're trying to save money as a student, like, you know, if you have some, like, rice, cook some rice, that'd be cheap just to cook a portion out of, like, a kilogram of rice, you know what I mean? And chuck it on top or even, like, with a bit of bread, like, That'll be more filling than just having it by itself. I know these spaghetti hoops. Probably, I don't know, I don't really have spaghetti hoops too much, but. Extremely soft. Uh, it's just the same sauce as the beans, I assume. Yes, that had a weird taste. What the fuck? The first bite was alright, but that second bite. Yeah, I mean, these are okay, they're pretty decent. This is the cheapest out of them all, 16p. For 16p, not bad, come on. I mean, I know spaghetti hoops are usually pretty cheap anyway, but if you get them from like, do Heinz do spaghetti hoops? Like, they'll probably be like 50p a pound, but you know, you're saving money over time. I'm liking them each bite more and more. Well, if you're a big child and you like them, it's not bad getting that for cheaper. Honestly, I was actually really shocked having these. Also, I wouldn't usually buy them because man skin, so I wanted to do it for a video, but really not bad. This isn't what I should be eating when it's like 25 degrees. I'm getting hot. I'm actually really impressed, funny enough. Like, not bad. Decent stats too. Mm. Mm -mm. I think I will actually eat all of this, but this video is already long enough, so I'm not going to eat anymore. I've tried each one. Honestly, not bad. Remember, check out the shorts tomorrow if you want me to try this awful looking rice that is 20, 28p. I'm going to crack a window. Give these a go, guys, if you're trying to save money, budget meals and that, you know what I'm saying? Not bad at all. Um, yeah, check out the other rest of the video. Thank you for watching. And bye-bye.